very common question here at Denny Wiggers is how do you make a bow? Well, I couldn't explain it, so I had to bring in my expert, Maritza Granados. And what she does is she has a rack of ribbon over here, and the bows are made from these ribbons. As you can see, we have a whole plethora of different types of ribbon. We have silk, we have plastic, we have a gold ribbon, we have a perforated ribbon over here, and during the Christmas season and throughout the year, Maritza and my other bow expert take these ribbons, fold it up, and we're going to do it in a moment. Come on over, Maritza. Maritza's chosen a plaid bow here, and what she's going to do is pull the, the ribbon out. How, how far out do you pull it? A, a couple of feet? Yeah, just a couple of feet. And we're gonna, she's going to show you how she's going to put this bow together right now. She folds it over, squeezes it, twists it, takes a little practice. You may want to try a couple, redo it, redo it again, see how she twists that bow, and she's making a loop here, and she's going to continue to do that. How many times, how many bows will you make? Depends then? how big you want your bow, how fluffy you want if, it. If you want a Normally, big fluffy, you do 10 quite loops. A, 10 loops. 15. You, you for can go 15. For a big wreath, you want to do between 20 25 lo loops. This is just for an, a regular size blanket, so I'm going to do like uh, maybe 10 loops. Wow, that is coming out beautiful. Do your hands get tired by using all those? Or are you bit. used to it by now? I'm used to it by now. After I don't know how many thousand bowls. Yeah. When you, then, when you made your first bow, did you think you could do a good job at it? No, and I want to cry. Yeah, but and now I, that you've been making them for years, look at that. Look at how gorgeous and fluffy. And that only took a minute or two. Not even, 30 seconds. Let's make another one over here. Can we use the gold ribbon? Sure. Now, as I explained to you in the blanket over here, we have some wire in here which keeps that bow fluffed up looking vibrant so it won't fall down over time she's doing the same thing like she did over here at the plaid bow does the 10 15 loops so you can get creative can you go out with one and in with one yeah let's try course. that let's go out a little bit further give it a little spice up you know fool around there's no set rule uh, every bow, there's no two snowflakes the same, there's no two bows the same. And being in the business a long time, the bows make the arrangement. They can really spice up your wreath or your blanket. And, and look at how gorgeous that's coming out. These usually come in rolls of 50 yards. And, you know, you can probably get you know, 20 bows out of a roll of ribbon, um, depending on how, how big you make the ribbon. And uh, what does a retail ribbon go for at the local craft shop? About $10 of, of, for a roll? $12? 12 in. Depending on, you know, the gold might be a little bit more, the, the regular burgundy might be a little bit less. Velvet is the uh, least, most beautiful and expensive ribbon for Christmas. See how she's spicing this up a little bit. And now, in a few moments, she's going to take a wire. And it goes. She goes right fingers. through. Bends it around. She's going to pull that tight. And that wire is going to be used to tie onto the wreath or the, uh, the, the door. Or now, how do we put this on to a garland or a blanket? We get a stake here. Here it is. Wow. Beautiful. And then, if you want to do it on a, on a ring, I'm going to show you also. Wire that we use to pull this ribbon together we're going to use to attach to the wreath. So 
see the little green wire, hard to see. She's pulling it through the frame and she's going to tie it on the back of the frame. Nice little family project. And anybody's welcome to come here at Denny Wiggers and pick out a ribbon or a bow and work with myself or Maritza. And we can make almost anything here. You can see here we have different, we have a burgundy ribbon, we have a regular plaid ribbon, we have a beautiful uh, a gold threaded ribbon over here. This has little wires in them to hold these bows up so they look vibrant and beautiful throughout the season, either they're on your wreaths or on your gray blankets or your Christmas decorations. Um, over here I have another burgundy, very nice plaid one, and also they are plastic ribbons that can be outside during the, uh, the snowy and the cold, rainy weather. So, you know, pick your choice. We can do almost anything for you. And, and now that you've seen how Maritza put these bows together, you can make them yourself.